The border fire is raging in the East County. So far, six communities have been evacuated. Two more are on alert. We have live coverage from Campo where people are waiting for word on whether to get out. Tenure supporter Jared Aarons is there live. Jared? Uh, Virginia, Melissa, we've been here all morning and that fire has been creeping closer and closer. You can see all of that smoke coming down the mountainside. Here's a look from Sky 10 at the intense flames of the border fire. It's now spread to more than 6,800 acres. It's just 20% contained and it's destroyed 16 buildings, including five homes. This morning, the message was simple to hundreds of firefighters near Potrero. Don't get complacent. Attack this fire. Cal Fire is going to use backburns to clear away fuel so it can't spread anymore. Meanwhile, I've heard about half the people in Campo say they are going to stay until they're told to leave. And that includes one worker at the Star Ranch who told me after four days, all of his horses are used to it. Put them in a corral and they were running all over, but a few hours later they were even enjoying the view. Now, Cal Fire says they will hold a community meeting tonight. That's at the Red Cross Evacuation Center, which is the Los Coches Creek Middle School. They're going to update everybody on the progress. They said that's especially for people who live in Potrero. That meeting starts at 7 p.m. Live in Campo, Jared Aarons, 10 News. Thanks, Jared. 10 News will continue our live coverage on the now at 4. We'll show you the progress on the battle against the fire and let you know how the evacuated animals are doing.